All right, I'm back. All right, Dave Brindle, how much am I making a month? I'm making 55, uh, here it is, down here. 55.81. Um, imagine Shaman not being in the Discord and targeting Maximus. <laughs> well, that's a good segue. Let's, uh, let's get to the leaderboard, y'all. So, oh, Shaman has started buying again. I guess this second half is going to be some whale watching after all. Okay. Okay. All right, well. Let's see where we're at after a little bit, huh? Uh, we might, uh, I might just let this go until he hits about 69k. Um, I have a prior arrangement, so if he's going to keep buying until 70k, I cannot guarantee that I'm going to be here for the 70k milestone. So, just letting you all know right now. Um, but yeah, let, let's get to the, let's see. I bought a legendary parcel from someone who had one for sale, putting me at 61 parcels in Canada. So now I'm at the 15x boost and kind of regretting it. Well, go ahead and just start buying to 100, Dave. Um, just start buying to 100. Honestly, if you're just buying legendary, like, I would have just bought four or five parcels. How much was the legendary parcel for, Dave? Now you're on the boat in the ocean watching a whale breach. <laughs> Yeah, Shaman is buying. Okay, so the King of Queens is planning on making a go at Shaman. That, that's going to be a bit. And I think Stealth bought one parcel. So Stealth is doing something too. But it's looking like it's going to be a while before the King of Queens can make a go at Shaman's uh, title. Uh... Stealth is pretty much a non-issue at this point. So, and I know that Count Maximus, Maximus Damages, um, he is probably not going to uh, continue anytime soon. So, we're left with the King of Queens and Shaman 15. So, uh, 150? Guy oh, 150 for a Legendary. No, absolutely. If I if I could get a legendary for 150, I'll take that all day. If I get a legendary for less than 400, that is a win. 400? Let me think. Um if a common parcel is no, if an average rare parcel is 100, then a legendary would be about 2 eight. so if it's un, if it's like under 250, it's definitely a win. So 150 is awesome. Outside of challenges, do you ever convert rent? Um, no. <laughs> I I cash out. I cash out, Ty. Matter of fact, I think I'm getting close to five bucks. Yeah, I'm very close to five bucks. Sometime by the end of the day, I'll get there. So I'll probably cash out tomorrow. Um. Found an epic selling for 300. That is not a good deal. So, if you want to know a break even, a good break even price on when to buy, um, <clears throat> we're going to, uh, let's do that. Let me go to a calculator. What is this? Okay, so um, the, let me see if this will actually take more than 10 digits. Give me a moment. Okay, so the average parcel is one, is this much basically per second, all right? It's this much. So what we're going to do is we're going to take the count for a legendary and divide that by the count for an average parcel. So this is a legendary. 277. Now, if I multiply that by 100, which is the average price of a parcel, 
This indicates the break-even point where you're coming out making money. So if you buy a legendary for less than 277 Atlas Bucks, you'll have ended up profiting. Now for an epic, you'd have to divide that by two. But if we divide that by two, then that puts us right below the minimum amount. So honestly, legendaries are the only way that you're going to be able to make anything worth it in this game. Uh, let's see. Found epics. Yeah. So Ty Ross, you from Maine. How much would King of Queens have to put in to get to the top? Well, 68,659 parcels minus 53,370. And we're going to assume, let's assume that Shaman 15 is going to hit 70,000 tonight. All right. 53,370. So it's 16,630. Um, let me get on Atlas Earth, the web browser version here. Um, I think that is a little more than $50,000 is what he's going to have to put in. The $50,000, oh jeez. Give me a little bit, y'all. Five bucks. Yeah, so it looks like to me he's going to have to buy one of these at minimum. So that's 14900 right off the bat. So minus 14900 So that put that's fifty grand plus something that's 173000 Atlas Bucks. So going back here, 173000 probably a 5000er, and then... Another thousand, so that's six thousand. I would say about fifty-seven thousand dollars is how much he's going to have to make uh, to put in. Fifty-seven grand. Um, obviously, I would absolutely not do that. And how many has he been buying so far? Okay, he's only bought like nine since since I was talking. But yeah, 57 grand basically is how much you'd have to uh, spend in order to overtake Shaman 15 right now. And that's not counting, um, that's not counting uh, him buying more. Which at this rate, I think Shaman 15 is going to break 100. He's going to be the first one to break 100. They are the first to break 100,000 parcels. I know someone mentioned that weren't quite sure. If male or female, um, we mostly go by male here, but uh, yeah, I'll go, I'll try to use proper pronouns, but you know, it's okay. <clears throat> so, um, yeah, I see. Okay, Shaman Fifteen is buying again. Looks like. Should I go buy? Should I go put down another ad here? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna see what ad this is first. Oh, there's my fake game ad. It's all the way in Atlas Earth. Ha! 